were flags waving on the streets. We'd never have known the Nazis were about to lose the war. But bullies are always loudest when they're scared. And when they're desperate, they get stupid. Commander Hermann Freisinger had killed Novak. Right. And he'd given us a free ride. Right into the lion's den. True. What a stupid fucking idea. The Reich. Right? Reich? Main security. Read the field report twice. Who the fuck is this guy? Fascinating. They have been captured. But it was too close. I want you to find out everything you can about this unit. It will be my pleasure, sir. Oh, he's you weird. To know and he's like a mad doctor, ain't he? Report directly to me. Al Hitler. He just gives me that vibe. He's weird. Alright, so we made it here. So they brought us all the way back, even though they... So I guess they figured they kill one random guy, Novak, in our unit that for whatever reason it would make us talk? I, I don't know. Wouldn't that guy have just like thought like maybe the dude would have been useful like Novak? Maybe he would have information that they could get it from. Chlorine dioxide. They think it hides the smell of death. So I and I. Extract the thing. And Polina, she's. Well, this is the nicest shit all I've ever been in. Is anyone else hungry? She just be talking shit. That's because of the gun. No vision. So. I am Hauptsturmführer Richter and Piss off, crowd. Unless you got room service for us. And I have questions for you. How are we gonna wait bloody questions? I'm the commanding officer. Did these guys know how to speak English well? Like I highly doubt that they were in like their You're office talking me. English. Well don't make it fucking weird, Even just talk then, to him. Richter was easy to read. Uniforms at high rank. No combat medals. Office rat. The perfect mark. Surrounded by three guards, all armed. And all wankers. So the fact that the guy is narrating the story is interesting. It makes me feel like he's alive. Even after this, no matter what happens here. Kingsley. Arthur. Lieutenant. Service number 2523. Two six four two. Tell you a story. I have spoken with the Fuhrer on exactly one occasion. He recommended a book to me, The Passing of the Great Race, by an American, a man named Madison Grant. The Fuhrer had nothing but praise for him. I'm sure. Fuck Madison Grant. And everyone like him. The book reveals that under extreme duress or unfavorable conditions, your people do not deteriorate so easily. I knew he was gonna do some shit like In that. that moment, I knew what I and he just face tanked it. What's up? Right to the supersternal notch, below the clavicle. Once we had what we needed from this racist bastard. That's where I would put my knife. My plan began to take shape. We were being held in the basement of Gestapo headquarters. That Around sounds like such a bad idea. Was a treasure trove of classified yeah, exactly. Nazi intelligence. You could just break out. We could Project do this shit like we did in Cold War. Had to be there somewhere, and Richter was our ticket. He thought he was the interrogator. Yeah, he's not very if scary. He to be of any use to us, the other guy's kind of scary. He'd this have to dude. Keep he that looks like a bitch. Nazi in his clean pressed uniform loved the sound of his own voice. Yeah. The hard part wouldn't be fooling Richter into spilling what he knew of Project Phoenix. I would like to see for myself. The hard part would be convincing the others not to kill him first. Yeah, I just I want to kill him so badly. It's so weird. <laughs> like I immediately already dislike him. I dislike this guy obviously because he smoked uh us initially, but I put their files. Take care of them with the other non-essentials. 
Who are you talking to? Imagine getting hired as a secretary for this shit. What the fuck? You answering phones? Like, hello? Lieutenant Kingsley mentioned a Project Phoenix. Likely allied propaganda. The Negro thought he was protecting his team. No doubt to prove himself. To make him their leader. The Allies must have been desperate. He's just a good leader. He said it was their first mission. That his sixth man is dead. He's probably lying. I will uncover the truth. <laughs> How did they learn of Hamburg? So why would he want to lie to his ally about him killing him? I guess because obviously that's out of line. Because they could have used him, like I was saying. There's more stake here. And he just killed him with a chair because he wanted to prove a point to Arthur because I mean he's a Nazi, he's racist, you know what I'm saying? Herita. You're counting on him, but I understand. I don't know, this dude is like a little weasel. I don't know. I feel like he's gonna stab him in the back. So like keep him alive and then have him stab him in the back and then we just take him out. Some shit. Like look at the way he's looking at him. These guys are barely even allies. Yeah, they kinda oh, fucked him up. Oh wow, the detail. They got the thing on the side of his neck. The, uh, the cigarette. Listen. They could at least smoke you know, weed no, or wait. some shit instead of tobacco. Yeah, I mean, seriously? I told him he was Might be able to think this out a bit better. On the train to Hamburg. I don't think they'll fall for it. But the hope is it'll buy him some time to get us out. He isn't coming back for us. He's right, Kingsley. We can't count on that fucking drone guy. Then he's back. Bring out the girl. Oh. She ain't going nowhere, mate. I'll just get out of my way. Well, Polito, no, he's, she's just like, man, get the fuck out of here. Don't stand up for me. I'm right here. Polito, interesting. Who's name is Yostomosis? Man, he's got, he knows Russian, he knows uh, German, speaks English. Like, he literally has it all. Holy fuck. Stalingrad 1942. Okay, so we're flashing back to Polina's person on this team story before she got in their own right. Long before their files ever reached my desk. But to say they were strong personalities would be a vast understatement. Particularly when it came to Petrova. Napolia, have you seen my... Again? It's bad enough I have to wear this thing at all. No, it's flammable. All those years teaching me how to shoot. Wasted. Stuck in the med tent. But, but, but still, mm. Yeah, she wants to actually help. Don't be in a rush. Or she feels like she's not a help being a nurse. Glory is worth nothing. When you're dead. But this fight, it matters. You matter. You and Misha are all I have left. I mean, look at the fabric. It looks great. Hey. He gets shot immediately. I'm always nice. Boom! Oh. Misha. Okay, I'm sorry. I've been traumatized or, or some shit. I'm sorry. I thought he was dead immediately. I thought we were going to see uh, Thomas or whatever his name was. His will be I forgot his name already. I'm sorry. to give explosives to civilians. you worry too much. Not to be on it on yet. Oh, Jesus, the look of that hurts. You did that well enough yourself. The plechka. Durin. Rigushka. Kazyol. Shaba. Both of you. I'm going to be late. Sit! Or? Oh, there. And the Isn't tea looks really nice? good. A real family breakfast. Like, graphically. Bombs and bullets. Best way to start the day. You know, you're gonna get yourself killed having that old rifle in the house, Papa. Yeah, I was gonna say, he's kind of pointing it at him now like that. Worried too much. 
So that thing's gonna save us. The Germans are approaching the front line. Is that where you're off to? No. You told me that's not where I'd be the most useful, so I'm training recruits at the old post office. Must be nice. Yeah, it would have been nice to have a choice on the map. At least you get to fight. Oh, don't tell me at least. You? Watch it. Okay. You're both doing your part. Which reminds me. I mean, obviously, it's a high tension of those situation. Get past you. You know where to send them. <laughs> of course, of course. They will never get through. Never. Blim. I need to run. They're waiting for me. Miss, you're. You weren't even here that long. You were already late if that's when you showed up. He would forget to keep his own head screwed on without us. We really are saints. Honestly. I'll make sure he gets this on the way to the med tents. You help your country much more than you know. And you make your old man proud. Spasiba, Papa. <laughs> Oh, the chair just appeared over there. We should replace your old chair. Never. It's comfy enough for me. It's been a while since I played this. You were a natural. Ah, I miss hearing you play. Misha and I were so little in this photo. Seems like just yesterday. So many impressive medals, Papa. It's your mother. She oh shit, this guy was like multiple prestiges and shit. Okay. Look at that. Alright. Respect. We go here. Be safe out there. Yep. Is it normal for people to just smoke inside like this? I mean... I guess, I guess there's a lot more very imminent things instead uh, as an issue right now. Not if you're out there fighting. Milimoy, the new partisans I'm training will crush them before they get close. I believe it. Good luck out there. Polina, Polina. Here to keep your brother out of trouble. Impossible. Okay. Oh, what's up? Who's this? Morning. Save some of our men today. Something smells good over here. Paulina, I saved the loaf for your family. Spasiba. <laughs> You're welcome. Your father has been bothering me for some Borodinsk. Of course he has. I'll come by and grab it later. Be safe at work, Paulina. Wanna move out? Buy this suitcase. Wait, her clothes are like... Shoes, shoes for kids. Wait, her skin right, is out of her Don't clothes. Like. have much more than this to sell? Okay, I gotta take this, what, to like soldiers or some shit? What's up? <laughs> Is this where I go? Make Molotov cocktails to Misha. Oh, they're Molotov. I thought we were just drinking. Forget something? You're a lifesaver. You know? Misha's pretty good. I should be going with you. You probably should. I have more practice than any of these Red Army Tabaki. Keep your voice down. You, you don't want to make enemies here. Fine. Just don't do anything I wouldn't do. Couldn't even if I tried. My aim is shit compared to yours. <laughs> uh, it's too bad we can't trade places. I would look great in that uniform. At least try. I mean, your outfit looks pretty cool. Thinking. One piece, several pieces, it's fine. I'm pretty good at putting people back together. Yes, ma'am. You've made me late again. I'll have to take the rooftops. You're gonna get yourself killed climbing around up there. I promise you can say I told you so if it happens. Now go! Go, go that's that's not even a good okay what the fuck wait there's just bricks sticking out okay that's strange oh you're the one that's doing it Yeah, it's like that. Yeah. Damn. Seems so sad here. Good morning. Up? Morning, Paulina. How is your father's leg? Finally improving. Thanks.
What the fuck? Have you been hearing? So. Don't worry. The Red Army will handle it. Well, be careful out there. Okay. Oh, more climbing. Hold on. What's over here? I guess we can climb. Oh, wow. Okay. So, no civilians or anybody else is... Okay. Oh, I climb here. Okay, your character just kind of teleports to the walls, though. Polina just kind of has superpowers or some shit, apparently. She knows her city so well that she could just traverse the all of the rooftops in the entire place. She has routes. We're playing Mirror's Edge with her. That even hurt that bad. Don't be a pussy. Drug broke down. This way's blocked. Move along. Uh, or? How do I go around? Ah. Uh. What the fuck is that slide? Holy sh! The medical officer will assign your duties. She's down the other side of the truck. Hey, do you not understand? Like, don't just like treat me like I'm just like some random nurse or some shit. Do you not see these slide cancels coming in here? You see this? Give men that catching up today. Go ahead, join the others. Okay. Oh God! Oh fuck! Ah! Holy fuck! Okay, we're running. We're running. It was such a nice city! Well, that's a way to clear the blockade. Oh my god! Oh, fuck. I feel like I'm doing that one BO3 mission. He told us so. Oh my god, we were so fucking dead. We were so dead. You help your country more than you know. And you make your old man proud. Okay, we're good. So the bomb never went off. We got a dud that landed next to us. Holy shit. It had full impact and it it just didn't what happens if I punch it? Okay. Hey! Get back inside, Meechan! Um, okay. Oh my god. Oh boy, you fucked up badly. <laughs> Einhorn. I heard that this thing actually, well, there was like only a hundred models ever made of this thing. Nobody even uses widespread in this war. There's like a hundred total made. Bing! 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 Alina, what have you done? You have to leave Stalingrad. Now. So do you. Shit. 
Everyone's gotta leave, including the birds. Oh, fuck. Search everywhere. Flush out the Russian vermin. Round them up. You Nazi bastards will kill you all. That was a mistake, old man. Oh, fuck. I'm coming, Dad. Hold on. gonna shoot him? Uh, the thing is, they would have just shot him if I had just pulled the trigger anyway. So like, what's the point? Come through! Shotgun's great for campaign. Holy fuck. This shit is so strong. Bop, 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 bop. Bop. Yeah. I'm assuming I can't avoid that anyway. They would have shot him anyway. You're literally, you were down the street. <coughs> you take care of each other. That's what we were doing this whole time. <coughs> Rip. Close his eyes, man. <laughs> yeah, okay. There you go. Let him actually rest. Shit, bro. And then you can keep that piece of cloth. Tell mom I'm off to save Misha. As usual. And she's like, fuck this medic shit. I'm going to cap these motherfuckers. No bullshit. Yup. Take that shit up. Now it's a rage fuel, Polina. All right, now I get it. I understand. Wow, I mean, not even knowing the characters before this, just like watching the, uh... Oh, man. I'm sorry. Um... Polina's keepsake rifle cannot be dropped. I like that. I must use it for later. Where is he going? What? What did I do wrong? Avoid moving in the open. There was nothing to do. I was watching a guy fly. Oh, I need to do this. Oh, shit. Get inside real quick. 
Oh shit! Oh, I didn't even see this. Okay. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh my fucking god! Lined it up. Lined it up. What the fuck? Oh my god, that's not how I wanted to do it. That's not how I imagined it either. It was so nice looking for a little while and it was gone so badly. Holy fuck. Why are there so many Molotovs? Requiem, that's the name. I just noticed it. Automaton. Honestly, Automaton might be kind of nice. I don't know about that site. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Oh, I go up here. My fault. Oh, no. There's no way they didn't see that. Save Misha. Huh? Are we still using the, the, the knife, the, the bread knife? I mean, it's not a bread knife, but like it was in the bread. I don't know what happens if I... I aggro all of them. Steiner kommt her und diese Russen verdünnen. Da ist doch jemand! Ein Aktivität! I didn't do anything. These guys upstairs? Private Misha. That shit took forever. It was incredible. Don't die. Now. Okay. Prosper, I, I, I was so scared that you and me. Uh, You're the one tied up. Take care of the others. What are you looking at him like that for? You know what? what's up? Yeah, you just got saved by a fucking medic. That's what's up, baby. Medic who? We talking Misha. medic sniper extraordinaire. Misha. No. We don't have time for this. He died. I know, we man. We have to get yes. your recruits yes. out of here. If we stay here much longer, we're trapped. Okay, so obviously the dad was supposed to die. I mean, you're right. I was like, huh, maybe I should shoot, but okay. there's no way that I could have gotten them all lined up to. This is not gonna happen. Misha, plan the escape we with need to Misha. Get to the Volta. How do we get out of this building? Misha, focus. How can we escape to the river? There's an exit here. We could make a run for the sewers, but the Germans are blocking the courtyard. It'll be tough. Do you have any extra supplies? Weapons? Anything I can use? I know there were soldiers defending on the roof. 
They had the radio. There might be supplies, too. All right. I'll lay down cover fire from there while you get our people to the source. If you're sure, sister, maybe you can reach the roof climbing up there. That should get you to the roof. I'll give you a boost. Oh, I'll find a okay. To cover you. I know. Well, we spend a better shot. Oh, more waves of enemies. We okay. Asha is with me now, and I know he wouldn't want us to die in this post office. My neck is tweaked. I, I don't know why. I think one of the times that I jumped, I actually fucked some shit up in my back. Okay, Ribeta. Once we're out on the street, stay hidden until Polina is in position. Holy fuck. There's no way she's this good at climbing. Wow. Polina, if you can hear me, find the radio. We had him not receiving. Boy, Boja, I hope you're listening to me for once. We are pinned down in the crater by the trolley. Accept your defeat! Waiting for your first shot before we start moving to the sword. Partisans, move! Now! Polina's got his attention! I don't think they understand where they're being shot from. Some of them do, but other ones, I, I mean... I have a fuck gun, honestly. Cypress sounds so different in campaign. I actually really like how this sounds. Okay, everyone, move to the sewer now. fuck am I supposed to get down, man? Need me to jump? Oh. Wait, they won't let me go in. Why? I don't know where I'm supposed to go! Where the fuck did they go? Oh, Fuck's sake. I die over so, so much dumb shit. Surviving Stalingrad was no small feat. Escaping, even greater. Yeah. I mean, but no one this really is bad. Something like that. The Nazi war machine had touched all our lives, burned away something important. I think that's what made us attracted to the SOE in the first place. But for Polina, the wound was marrow deep. She was destined to return the favor. They're unarmed. That made dude. her the deadliest member of my team. All right, yeah, we see where Polina came from. All right. Yeah, you ain't gonna hear shit from her. Such a touching story. You couldn't even save the life of your own father. I mean, where's so your me, dad? Why isn't Ivan with an old rifle part of a top secret allied operation? Who's Ivan? You do not scare me, little mouse. Oh, shit. That's not scary either. What's up? Fuck it. You misunderstand me, Fraulein. I do not need you to fear me. So why are you acting like it? I need only your screams. That will convince your friends to talk. Why? <laughs> because I am a woman. <laughs> I 
that pretty much confirms he's not very good at his job. Tell me. That got to him. What other missions the allies have? In Fuck Germany. you. Nothing worth talking about. So. What is worth talking Damn, about? Damn, you guys are only smoking cigarettes out here. Rising. Singer, whatever that means. Go fetch him. Who? I can confirm my story together. <laughs> Take her back. Send me all the records on a Commander Steiner and any photographs of the Russian sniper, Lady Nightingale, yes. That oh, that's actually such a hard nickname. Herr Freisinger, I was just coming to see you. We have confirmation from the woman. The sixth ally is dead. Is that so? Oh, right. She said that he's the one that killed our beginning guy. An American arrested at Tempelhof trying to steal a plane. This makes no sense. Prisoners made a fool of you, Richter. And now you have made a fool of me! Well, he's lying, isn't he? The American is being brought here now. If I must interrogate him myself, then I have no use for you. Look how much of a bitch he is when the other guy's around. He is so pussy. Shit. You hurt? Are you blind? Yeah, no shit. Just try. Surprised that her nose is still. What did you tell them? We traded torture tips. Relax. I told the same lies as you. Did he believe you? I stopped asking when I brought up Freisinger. <laughs> Who's next? When we get out of here, the first thing I'm going to do is head to the pictures. See les trois mousquetaires. Let Edith Merard break my heart all over again. And you, Lucas? What the fuck does that even mean? What's the first what thing? What is this haiku right shit? What are we talking about? We're dying! When I get home, I'm eating lamingtons for a week. What the fuck is a lamington? All cakes, all the time. I know what you miss. Yeah. I like to have that sweet bird Barbara pour me pints of my local until I forget this infernal war ever happened. Oh I shit, this is Lamington. Oh shit, it's like a cake. Everyone I love is dead. And the only time I feel anything is when I watch a German beg for his life. Well, I mean, it's pretty much the same so thing with him, so... I am exactly where I need to be. He said you only need your screams. I mean, that dude is evil. Wade showed up just as I'd hoped. Oh, there's Wade. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say, wasn't there another guy? The team had written him off, but I was counting on him being his usual is he the American? charming self. <laughs> Try that again, Crowd. And yeah. we're gonna have a real fucking problem. Your team lied about you, Lieutenant. Lieutenant. Uh, now, is that so hard? Finally, some respect. I know you are the sixth man. Uh, what did you want with that plane? <laughs> you Nazis. You make me miss fighting in the stinking Pacific. I want to know what else they've lied about. I don't- I can't even tell who's lying anymore. I just know what I've seen. Uh, what the fuck is going on? Wade had talked himself out of worse situations. If you heard him talk about Midway, you could tell he was no stranger to hyperbole. Every time Wade told the story, it was a little different. He added a wing of Zeros or another aircraft carrier to his tally. But I read the reports about what happened that day. 
Oh, he's a it pilot. Right, right, right. It was only by a little. So he's like, he's a real shit, though. 